Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to QCR. Today we're gonna polish the side of my truck right here. Huge scratches, all right here. All caused by the uh, automatic car wash, the drive-through car wash. I got a membership, I go almost every day, keep it clean. I know I shouldn't, I continue to go, but I shouldn't go. So I'm gonna show y'all how to remove these scratches. We got some, uh, we got this Torque Random Orbital Polisher. I got the orange pad on it. You can buy this from Chemical Guys or Amazon or whatever. Got the Griot's Garage brand new ultra premium microfiber uh, towels to remove the polish and I put some wax on it. Today, I wanna be using this. This is really good stuff. Griot's Correcting Cream. Really amazing stuff right here, guys. Pretty awesome. I'm gonna show you how to apply this. I'm gonna put it right here on this orange pad. We're gonna move these big, nasty scratches. Let me, I'm gonna try and bring us in, see if we can get a good view of these. So, you can see here, this right here is from the car wash. All these swirls and scratches all over the place. Look how nasty that is. All down here. All the body line is scratches from the car wash. It's pretty gross. We're gonna go through here, I'll polish it out. We're gonna do like a little one by one area and I'm gonna show you how to do it. All right, everybody. So usually what you would do before you start polishing, you wanna clay it. I already clayed it because this video is not about clay, it's about polishing. So we got our correcting cream. I've been shaking it up, but you're supposed to shake it up first. I'm using the orange pad, that's the second, second to uh, harshest pad or roughest pad uh, that, that you can find. I think the next harshest one is yellow. Just put a couple of dabs on there. Just like that. Probably too much right there in the middle, but that's my first pass, so we're gonna put a lot. Take, put the cord over your shoulder, kind of blob it on like such. Get in there real good. Set the, set the speed setting to a one. You're gonna turn it on, you're gonna make three passes up, three passes back, just like that, just for a few minutes. Good thing about this Griots here is you can do it a lot and it won't burn your paint. It's formulated, perfect for uh, for us new people, don't know what we're doing yet. So, we're gonna go right here, try it for a few minutes and see what happens. All right, I got it all smeared around right here. Now I'm gonna set the speed setting to a five. Set it on five, make my passes up and down, left and right, up and down. We're gonna wipe it off and then do it again. Let's see what we got. Bring y'all in for a close-up. Well, can't really tell. Look at my flashlight. So there's still some scratches on this side. Still some scratches right here. Right there. I don't know if y'all can see that. Right there. 
I have to go over a few more times. All right, guys. Pass number two. A couple little drops right here. That's all you need. I'm just gonna go ahead and turn it up to a five and just go for it. See that in the camera. I don't think you can see it. It looks pretty good except for a couple little spots right here. So I think the way the sun is angled right now, I might be able to see it really good. But we're gonna work on this. I know y'all can see that, so we'll work on that. Gotta open it. Dabs on here. That's too much. That was too much right there. Alright, let's work on this rough spot so you can really see how good this real is. Alright, lot better there's the scratch Let's see if we can get that scratch on here there's all the scratches but Paul it is a little bit right there see a little bit right there probably gonna go over a few more times get that out Right there. All right, let's do pass number two. All right, pass number two, guys. Crank it up to a five. Alright, 
All right, let's wipe it off. Wiping it off. We're gonna get us a fresh towel. Fresh towel here. Look how easy it comes off. It doesn't stick, doesn't powder up. Really good stuff. I'm not even selling this stuff. I do have a link in the description though. Link in the description for this stuff. Not sponsored. Okay, so where's our scratch? There's all the kinds of swirls, but there's our big scratch. That's right there a little bit. It's polished pretty good, except for that little scratch. Right there. Probably need a compound and a wet sander for that big old thing. But, for the main part, got most of the swirls out. All those. I'm trying to get where the sun hits it, so. So this looks like there, and there's still some up here. What you gotta do is you gotta go over it a few times. A few times to get it all out. We're gonna go over it some more, probably three or four more times. I'm gonna finish this out, guys. I'm gonna finish this the rest of this truck out, and uh, I'm gonna show you how the finished product looks like. So this is one pass in this new little area right here. So you can see the swirls. And then they kind of disappear. That's what it looks like. So that's one pass. We gotta make a couple more passes because I can see them here. You probably can't pick them up on the camera. But I see them pretty good. We'll do a couple more passes and then we'll get to this section over here. Let's see what it looks like in the reflection. That's what the reflection looks like. So I got a couple holograms in here. I don't know if you can see them right there. So we're gonna swap to this blue pad. Got a blue pad, it's less aggressive than the orange pad. We're gonna take the same Griot's polisher. I got a couple of spots right there. And we're gonna go over just a quick once over, maybe a twice over. Wanna remove those holograms and make this thing really pop. There's like a little, like a little smoky or haze to it. Gotta remove that haze. All right, so let's get started. Run dirt into my paint. Just a little bit. Just a little bit is all you need. There's still a uh, polished film on here. <laughs> So, I don't know if you can see it, the scratch was right here. Most of it's gone, still got a little bit left. A little bit of swirls. A little bit, not too much. So, we're gonna go over this, a blue pad, the whole thing, a couple more times. Should get all those little holograms out. So, as you can see here, there's the sun. I don't really see much swirls or scratches or anything in there. So it's pretty good. I had to move my truck to get back in the sunlight. Little spot right there. 
Maybe that's just grease. And the polish. Man, it looks good. Alright guys, as you can see here, my glasses on. Got finished polishing it out. Looks pretty good. Can't even really see where that scratch was over here. Man, that looks good, guys. Looks real good. Looking sharp, guys. If you like uh, my video here that I did, give me a thumbs up, guys. I really appreciate it. Uh, also, give me a thumbs up for my mustache. I really appreciate that, too. All right, uh, so we polished it. it. Took a couple hours, actually. I did. Uh, had to wash my orange pads out twice. Then I use my blue pad. Um, just take some time. If you're a newbie like me, I'm a newbie, not a professional. So just take your time. Do one section at a time and, you know, let it all get done up real good and, and see how well you're doing. Do it again. Do it again. Keep going until you're uh, pretty good at it. Keep going until you like what you see. All right. Give me a thumbs up. Thanks, guys.